Yeah, I mean, it's it's no joke. I mean, you had to train yep. for a particular amount of time. It's 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 a very intense workout that you have to condition your body for. Tell me about the training process. Yeah, so uh, when uh, I – and it, this even goes in with Sean because with Sean, we used to go down there at Saturday morning – and we would train all day. We we would train till five, six o'clock at night, and we'd videotape it and go back and watch it, watch things that we did, uh, how we did it. If we met, thought we messed up, we we'd make little marks and stuff of where we messed up, how to improve it. And I think that really helped me for when I I got hooked up with Shane in the House of Horror Core too, uh, because when I went down there, it it was very strict. Hey. You had to be at the building at 8 o'clock, and at 8.01, that door got locked. If, if you missed three days or, or three training sessions, you were out. Man, really? No second chance. There was no, hey, I got traffic, you know. Nope. Sorry, bud. You know, door's locked. Once that door's locked, forget it. So we got down there, and then, you know, you started – Start doing your calisthenics and everything, you know, box squats, push-ups, sit-ups, you know, push-ups, everything. And then, you know, you get in the ring and it was like, all right, we're going to run the ropes, you know. And so we would be sitting there running the ropes for a minute and a half. And the thing was, is that, so Shane would sit there with his watch and he would time you. And he wouldn't even watch you in the ring running because, you can literally, it's almost like somebody playing the music. It, it's such a, a timing thing. And when you're going across that ring, you're just listening for the steps. So it's like, boom, 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 boom. But when you hear boom, 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 it's like, nope, you messed it up, man. Stop, stop, stop. And the thing, thing too, man, he would let you go until you were at like that one minute, 20 seconds. And then he's like, stop, stop, nope. I heard three steps, man, at one minute mark, start over. And now you got to start over and he wants a certain pace. You know, it's, there's no little lag. If you don't keep that whole pace going that whole time, stop, start over, get it going, you know. And then we would go out and we do little runs sometimes, you know, sometimes be two miles, maybe five miles uh, around New Brighton, come back to the school get in there and then we start training. Uh, and then the training sessions would go until two, sometimes two o'clock, sometimes four o'clock in the afternoon. And now we're finally getting done and getting out of the ring and stuff. And it's like, all right, be here tomorrow. <laughs> You're talk back about the next day. Yeah. Talk about a crazy schedule. That just sounds unbelievable. Yeah. yeah. But it, it was grueling. 